हेलो एवरीवन एवरी वन नमस्कार वेलकम टू उड़ान दीपक यूट्यूब चैनल एंड आई एम दीपक फ्रॉम उड़ान दीपक एकेडमी हुबली नाउ लेट अस मूव ऑन टू डिस्कशन ऑफ मोस्ट इंपॉर्टेंट दैट इज द मोस्ट एक्सपेक्टेड पेपर प्रिपेटरी एग्जामिनेशन फॉर जनवरी 2026 सो दिस इज द पार्ट टू ऑफ माई डिस्कशन इन पार्ट ए आई हैव डिस्कस द फिजिक्स in part b i will be discussing all the chemistry and part c i will be discussing entire biology so let us go to discussion of the answers now c the substance which changes blue litmus paper into red litmus paper you know that acids converts what blue to red so a b r we have to write down that means acids converts blue to red yes and uh, the, the acids gastric juice is a acid so let me know in the comment section that which acid is present uh, in the stomach uh, that we call it as gastric juice in this case okay so coming to the next one now if the thermit uh, reaction is used to join the railway tracks the reactant used in this uh, reaction are you know thermit reactions is a reaction it is a highly exothermic reaction it is from the metals and non metals and the reaction here is iron oxide reacts with aluminium so aluminium in there there crack machine parts aitu railway track aitu avella onnu naavu illi join maadlikke enaithe use maartivi okay so the reaction which is used to join the railway track we call it as what thermit reaction so you should know the answer here the aluminium and the iron oxide fe2o3 then the number of covalent bonds present in cyclopropane so cyclopropane alli eshtu covalent bonds adav anthe illi kelidare so how to propane so what is the meaning formula for cyclopropane cn h2 get propane is 3 c3 x6 bartithi so in the form of cycle you should write this so here how many bonds you can see here so 1 2 3 4 1 2 3 4 And one, two, three, four. So one, two, three. Let me do just one more. No, really, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So the right answer is what? Nine per meter six cella. So in cyclopropane, so we need to have what? Nine bonds here, not the uh, six. Okay, now I put for the cyclopropane only. Uh, the number of covalent bond in the molecule of uh, cyclopropane is a bond formed between uh, the number of bonds. Covalent bond here is there. Oru yes, covalent bond here is there. Not the bonds. The covalent bonds is a bond formed between. the two uh, this okay so carbon and carbon are having the single bond and the c cyclopropane means what c6 uh, c3 h6 so 1 2 3 so here how many bonds you can just count here so the number of bonds are uh, number of bonds is here there are covalent bonds see 1 2 3 4 Five. Sorry, this is not the uh, five or six. So these are the covalent bonds here between carbon and hydrogen. So they are six. Okay. Now coming to the next one, application of baking soda on stung area of honey bee gives relief. So you know, all the honey bee cut to the vein part there. All the end to go be clear. You should take. Uh, द बेकिंग सोडा एंड रम मी रम ऐन है यू नो दैट द हनी बी कन्सेंट आफ वाट फार्मिक आसिड विच इज रेस्पासीबल फॉर् पेन आंड इरीटेशन अल ना बेकिंग सोडा हचको बेकिंग सोडा अंदर ऐन है अब बेस अद हचकोबिट्रेन दू विट रिफ सो यू नो दैट बेकिंग सोडा इज अ बेस इट न्यूट्रल द रियान अंत बरी सी बेकिंग सोडा हाज अ बेसिक प्रॉपर्टी and it neutralizes the acid released by the b and you know that the acid released by b is which one it is the formic acid that one you should know in this case and the right the structure of benzene see benzene structure is what the one which you can see here and it consists of alternate double and single bond one single bond it is one double it is single double single double single double you should 
no in this case so here you can see single bond and the formula is cc6 very important it is ellari nana pidkori the formula for a benzene is cc6 and benzene has alternate double bond single bond double bond single bond and this is a structure of what benzene benzene is used as aromatic hydrocarbon and benzene smell uh, producing in perfumes and all it will be used okay next name the precipitate formed when barium chloride reacts with the sodium sulfate so this one again very important you should know with the help of equation here so what is the question barium chloride that is bacl2 it reacts with sodium sulfate na2so4 you have an acta we will cool bidta avu and this and this will get up so here baso4 plus 2 nacl what will be t 2 nacl now the right answer is what this is the white color precipitate here that is barium sulfide you should even know the equation here nana pidko beku equation ille nana pidko beku yes i hope you all are connecting here so next one you can see observe the reaction taking place so nim textbook alli iddanta idu picture in the given write the balanced chemical equation of the reaction taking place you know that here calcium oxide when added to water cao plus water will give sodium uh, calcium hydroxide that is quick line and you let me know what which line it is called in the comment section below idan na we enu antheyte veli calcium oxide is called as what it is quick line when it is added to water it will form calcium hydroxide idan yena karitarvi in the comment section alli nanu haki helbeku and you know that this is an exothermic reaction okay see whether it is endothermic or exothermic since heat is liberated in the reaction it is called exothermic reaction and you know all the combination reactions are what all the combination reactions are not that we heard we call it as exothermic reaction of the navile hate we okay so let's come into the next one now a student touch the some household material oba vakti en martana head student vidyarthi household material with the ph paper and prepared a charts of respective colors what he observed our note that material lime juice then color in it the orange it to distilled water then green i to mad milk of magnesia blue i to gastric juice red i to sodium hydroxide violet i to name the acidic material which is more acidic name the basic material which is more basic idralli you note bodu the acidic material idralli highly acidic yav it the lime juice okay and the lime juice i to gastric juice i to is more acidic so acidic material are lime juice and gastric juice red color i think you know acids convert blue to red to blue so the more red the more acidic it is so red is more acidic so therefore the more acidic is red that is gastric juice similarly basics are milk of magnesia and sodium hydroxide and it those are you can see acidic is lime juice and gastric juice gastric juice is more acidic because it is red in color and you know that acids converts red to blue okay so uh, acids convert uh, what blue to red sorry acids converts blue to red so more the red more the acidic it is basic so basis converts red to blue so nim gottaiti the basic ol again aagti theli more the blue more the basic it is milk of magnesia in it all sodium hydroxide ile itri uh, that is violet which is more basic see basic materials are milk of magnesia sodium hydroxide and sodium hydroxide is more basic distilled water you you should know green color and distilled water is neutral in this case okay coming to the next one now observe the following reaction al2o3 6 hcl alcl3 and you know that aluminum oxide so aluminum oxide is an oxide zinc oxide are the two example for amphoteric oxide and you looking at this equation you can tell that aluminum oxide it reacts with both acid well as base to produce salt and water such a reaction we call it as uh, amphoteric reaction amphoteric oxides 
So what are amphoteric oxides tell me? The oxides which reacts with the both acid as well as base. Okay. So what are amphoteric oxides? The oxides which reacts with both acid as well as base to produce salt and water. You know that aluminium oxide it reacts with acid to produce salt and water, and aluminium oxide reacts with base to produce salt and water. What conclusion will you arrive for nature of aluminium oxide? It reacts with both acid as well as base to produce salt and water. That is what the conclusion you should give in this case. Okay. Now aluminium oxide is amphoteric in nature. Aluminium oxide reacts with both acid as well as base to produce salt and water. That is the answer. Then here you can see copper uh, sulfate reacts with iron to form ferrous sulfate and uh, copper. Ferrous sulfate reacts with zinc to produce zinc sulfate and iron. On the basis of this reaction among iron, zinc, copper, identify metal which is more reactive. Here you should know what the reactivity series. Please stop calling me a careless zebra. Here the number of the here the number of what should you know here is. So I need to know. Please stop calling me. You na kora da. Yaga mana mudile. Please stop calling uh, me a careless zebra. Instead, try learning how copper makes and saves gold. Now you know the most reactive element. Yaar ek mudile. Zinc is first reactive. Second iron and third one copper. This is a trick to remember. Now you see that zinc is more reactive. Zinc is uh, C. Zinc is more reactive uh, and copper is least reactive. Therefore, zinc displaces iron. So zinc displaces iron from uh, is salt and iron displaces copper from its salt. You know that uh, the most reactive element displaces the least reactive element. And in this case, by using the reactivity series, you got to know zinc is more reactive and copper is least reactive. Yar alone was not iron. Iron is more uh, reactive than. Uh, Copper, yes. So iron is more reactive than copper. Therefore, iron displaces uh, copper sulfate from copper. Uh, uh, copper from copper sulfate solution. And zinc is least reactive. Okay, zinc is more reactive than iron. Iron. Therefore, zinc uh, displaces iron sulfate from iron. Uh, iron from iron sulfate solution. So both iron and zinc are what? Uh, iron and Zinc are more reactive than copper, so that is what you should write the answer based on this one. Okay, now you can see give one example for each of the decomposition reaction in which he, uh, heat, light, and electric current is used. Heat thermal decomposition reaction is heat heating of limestone. So you can see calcium uh, carbonate that is limestone when heat you will get calcium oxide that is quick lime and carbon dioxide. Second one is light. That is electrolyte. Sorry, second one is electricity. That is electrolyte in decomposition, electrolysis of water, and water it decomposes into when you pass electricity to H two plus O two. Similarly, you can see what electro photolyte in decomposition exposing silver chloride to silver uh, sun, uh, to sunlight. So you can see silver chloride, which is white in color, when you pass sunlight, it will become gray. That is silver and chlorine will be formed in this. Yes, I hope you are understanding. If you are finding this, I expect you to kindly like uh, in the comments. Put a like in the comment section below. Then, what is corrosion? See the deterioration of metal as a result of chemical reaction between it and surrounding environment is called corrosion. Mention the measures used to prevent, you know, by painting, marbodu, oiling, grease, etc., marbodu, galvanizing, making alloys. All these are example for what? These are an example for the. Uh, corrosion. That what are ionic compounds? You know the bond formed by the transfer of electron from metal to a non-metal. Another one metal ethi, one non-metal ethi. CnCl is an example for ionic compound. And sodium is a metal, chlorine is a non-metal. Yeah, do put in that that very ionic bond. Ati thi. See the compounds formed by transfer of electrons from metal to a non-metal are called ionic compounds. So the properties are they are solid and hard. They are generally brittle. They are high melting and high boiling point. They are soluble in water and they are insoluble in organic compounds such as uh, you can see. Uh, 
such as petrol, diesel, ionic compounds conduct electricity in molten state and solution form but uh, not in solid state. Then what is an alloy? Mention the constituent of the following uh, alloys. See alloys means what those are the homogeneous mixture of both metal and um, they can be both metal or it can be metal and uh, non-metal. Okay. And you should know here one thing that solder it is lead and tin. Solder is used in the electro motherboard only uh, the electric or tonic uh, components joint product use martari bronze copper and tin. Bronze is used in making metals bronze metal and all. Okay. Then coming to the diagram here, very important uh, diagram you people will be knowing. Okay, I hope the diagram you can see. See, this is a pop sound diagram. Zinc granules for to delivery tube on the mark mark. I hope all are practice smart. Then name the saturated and unsaturated hydrocarbon which has same molecular formula of C3H6. Write the structure formula. Do you think uh, that this has structural isomers? Give reason. See the saturated hydrocarbon is cyclopropane which is having uh, the, the single bond. So C3H6 is what? Uh, this is uh, unsaturated hydrocarbon double bond it is propene. But in this case it is cyclopropane because since it has single bond is cyclopropane. Structural formula just now we have a drawn in the beginning. This is cyclopropene and unsaturated hydrocarbon for this is propene which is 3 carbon and between 1 carbon you are having double bond. Yes, these are structural isomers because they have same molecular formula but different structure formula. So like this you should able and capable to solve and I request everyone those who are watching to kindly register for Udan scholarship test which will be conducted on Friday that is 16th January 2026 timing 8 pm. The link is provided in the description box below and you will be having uh, uh, what here you can find the summer vacation camp for your juniors so it will be from april 1st to may end so uh, you can just inform the convey the message to your juniors they should come mobile and they should attend the uh, physical classes here okay offline classes and if you still want to uplift your studies you can just get our udang books so you can just uh, uh, which will be delivered at your doorstep in two three working days you can visit our website www.udangdeepak.com i'll you give you order marbo with this i take a leave but the session till then take care keep learning but you keep brain so all the very best.